Kevin, I'm going to ask you the most obvious question in the world. You must be absolutely delighted with that. Yeah, of course. Um, brilliant result. Absolutely brilliant result. Kevin, we spoke before the game about the run that they're on. And I mean, the, the two clubs off the pitch couldn't be any more different. Um, but on the pitch, we were really, really so good tonight. And a couple of things tonight that did change. And again, I said to the players, if you just keep doing what we're doing, things will change. We were clinical. We were two really... I think probably well Dale had a chip that was unlucky. But that's going to really, I think three 0 up at one side, which is mad when you think about it. Way to to Shamrock sh- Rover. We we're clinical and then we defended so so well in our box. No real mistakes. Again, Rovers are hundred percent for the first maybe twenty, twenty five minutes they were getting in in between. But that's again because of the quality they have out of them. But the lads stuck to the plan. Obviously the plan was very <laughs> simple in some sake. They were staying compact and hitting Freddie when we can. And some people might think it's long, but certainly not long ball when you're Freddie Draper up there, as you see from his goal. And then Dale's goal, it's just, it's a, it's a long pass, like, you know, down the side. Of, we know that Robert's like to leave one on ones a lot of time, and we were backing Freddie, and, and it worked tonight. And Dale Rooney with that goal, his first touch before the finish was like, world Yeah, class. it was great. It was great. And again, Dale and Freddie and Darren Markey and Dylan, and even Adam Foley last week when he came on, he hasn't played much. They've all had chances over the last few weeks. and set pieces, Connor, Manny, but we've had lots of chances in games and again, people get bored of talking about mm. XG and stats and we've been, we're right up there, but tonight, I was talking to Stephen about what we were saying before the game and they were the same at the start of the year, playing well but not getting results. We've been playing really, really well and picking up the odd point but over the last few games, but this is certainly a, a place to come and, and, and turn it around. Um, it was just, I know I couldn't be prouder of the, the players, they're absolutely magnificent. What a boost as well coming into your next matches against UCD and Cork City, which I presume were matches that you were targeting. Well, yeah, look, you try again, I know it sounds stupid, you try and pick up stuff in every game, but they will again, the bodies will hopefully get a few bodies. You could see, like, our lads are dead, and, and this isn't anything about it, but our kids on the bench, like, under 19, they're all under 19 on the bench, the after Adam Foley come on. And that's not to say you can't play under 19, they play the 17 year old again, Pats. It's just, again, coming into tally, like, I mean, Every bit of experience is, is, is vital and necessary. We don't have it in 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 the squad with in, in uh, abundance or anything. We're we're, we're struggling um, numbers wise, but it's a massive massive boost. And, and to get get through that uh, game and, and to beat Shamrock Rovers two one, I know we said we have a good record against them, but I think this I think is the best one. Yeah, enjoy it. Congratulations. Thanks, Colin. Thank you.